So just giving an update on our bathroom. Um, we ended up closing off this cabinet here to give more space for the bathroom. We're going to have a 36 inch, or we do have a 36 inch door here that's going to open up this way for wheelchair access. Walking in, we have an inlet here for storage space, hook there. Um, the floor we had pitched towards this four foot drain over here. Uh, reason is we wanted everything, everything to flow this way so we didn't have to have a closure here. So there's not going to be a glass door, a curtain, or anything like that. Uh, it's just going to be a walk-in shower. Another inlet for storage. Uh, we have an adjustable shower head here, which you can move up and down or take off as you need it. It's also a uh, official grab bar and it's tied into studs behind the wall here. So you can use it as a grab bar if you need to. Um, the rear switch here, which you can turn down this way for the shower head here or turn it up to use the shower head up here. Temperature control here. We have a small wall, which we don't have yet, but we're gonna put a glass pane here. That's gonna go up almost to the ceiling. Um, storage space in that small wall. Toilet. Our vent over there, which you can goes out to the outer wall, which you can control here. Control for the main lights and then the shower lights are here. And last thing is we're gonna have a mirror that goes above the sink that pivots. So anyone standing, you can leave it centered, and then anyone that's sitting in a chair, you can pivot downwards. Um, last thing, sink with enough knee space for someone to, to um, be able to wheel underneath. Um, might do something to conceal this later, but project for another day. So um, that's it.